So guys, welcome to the Future Internet Cafe. My name is Catherine and in today's video we are going to look at how to link your business on BRS. Please note that all businesses registered before the year 2016 need to be linked on the BRS portal. So to start, go to ecitizen.go.ke and click on sign in. So once you click on sign in, it's going to take you to the login page. Enter your email address or your ID number based on whatever you use. Enter your password and click on sign in. It's going to open your eCitizen account. Confirm that all the details that you have entered are correct and that you're using your own profile. Scroll down and click on BRS. Once you click on business registration service, it's going to tell you to confirm that you are logging in with the following details. Confirm that they are yours and click on continue. Once the BRS portal opens, click on link a business. Enter the name of your business and click on search. It's going to display an option with all the names that are associated with that name. Choose the one that applies to your business and click on next. It's going to open um, the edit details. You can be able to edit the details of your business name or registration number. That is in case anything is wrong. But if all the details are correct, click on save and continue. Check your capacity and the nature of the business. Are you the proprietor or are you a representative? Then click on save and continue. Next step is to update the registered office addresses. Please enter the address of your business. Click on save and continue once you are done. Next stage is the ownership information. So you can add a proprietor or edit the existing details. Then click on save and continue. So when you click on add a proprietor, you are required to choose the designation, the ID type. Enter the ID number and the first name of the proprietor. Then click on verify. Upload the passport photo of the proprietor, then click on submit after entering all the relevant details such as address. Okay, the last step is to submit and review your information. No payment is needed and no document is needed to be uploaded. So once you make sure that all the details are correct, click on submit and review and wait for BRS to review your application and approve it. Thank you so much for watching. My name has been Catherine and that's how you link a business on BRS for all businesses that are registered before the year 2016. Until next time, bye bye.